this Valentine's Day, you must fall with love. Welcome to my channel. This is Joy from She Speaks Too. If you are new, welcome. And if you are not, um, thank you for coming back. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. So today we're going to be talking about Valentine's Day. Um, not something that was really popular amongst Africans when I was growing up, but um, if you're in Rome, you must do like the Romans. So we are going to pamper our African women. I'm going to tell you men what to do. You need to listen. Listen, listen, oh, we are infinerous. Listen to spoil this woman, make her feel like a queen. Let's face it, African women are the hardest working women that I have seen in my life. In Liberia, you see market women pushing wheelbarrows. You see them, they're hustling. They're trying to bring food for their families. They're trying to send their children to school. So men, this Valentine's Day, I don't care if you celebrate it, you don't celebrate it, you need to honor the woman in your life and let me tell you how. Listen, what did I say? Well, you're infinerous. Open your infinerous. Listen to me. And let me just add this. You don't have to wait till Valentine's Day to honor the woman in your life um, to spoil her. So don't let it be once a year. Make, make this a habit. Okay, one of the easiest, most cliche things you can do is send her flowers to her work. Um, I'm not a flowers person, but it's not about that. It's the fact that someone took the time out of their day, um, sent me flowers, and it's, Joy, um, you have something at the front desk. You go to the front desk and you have flowers. Then as you're walking back to your office, everyone's looking at you, oh, look, her husband sent her flowers. So it's not even the fact that I even like flowers, it's the thought behind it and the attention you get from other women. So even if your wife or your significant other doesn't like flowers, it's the thought that counts and it's the attention that other people give her that elevates that experience and makes it so good. So think about that. That's one of the easiest, anyone can send flowers, anyone can send a fruit um, bouquet, like edible arrangements, anyone can do that. It's very simple. So that that's one of the easiest things. That's one of the most cliche things. And if you're not a romantic man to begin with, even that gesture could rock her world. I mean, could rock her world, you don't know. So if, if that's something that you can do, do that. That's one of the easiest things you could do. So number two, you can spoil her with her favorite meal. Now, if you don't know how to cook, let's say her favorite meal is like tobagi. You can have someone cook that for her and present it. Now, men, make sure the person that's cooking this for her that she actually likes. Because if you don't, if someone cooks for her that she doesn't like, now that's just witchcraft. I'm not gonna eat food from someone I don't like. So, <laughs> so don't get yourself in trouble ask the appropriate person to cook her favorite meal. And then it's even easier if her favorite meal comes from a restaurant, you can use um, Uber Eats, Grubhub, DoorDash and have her meal delivered. Tell her, baby, don't cook today. I have something coming for you. And it's her favorite meal. So you should know her well enough to know what she likes to eat. And like I said, make sure if you're having a meal prepared for her, it's from the appropriate person. It better not be from that person she don't like because that is witchcraft pure wish crap so i don't eat from anyone i don't like so keep that in mind open it open your ignorance so number three number three perfume perfume is easy is there a scent that she's been kind of looking at maybe it's too expensive um maybe it's something that she just hasn't gotten around her favorite perfume is empty she hasn't gotten around to um, fill it women are easy you don't have to go against the grain it can be something as simple as my perfume is getting low it's one of my favorites and you su you surprise her with that perfume women we are so easy it's the thought that counts and we like to feel appreciated so it's the thought that counts that is so easy refill her perfume or get her a new one that you say babe I think this will smell so good on you um, I took my time and I researched and this is what I got you you could rock her world you could rock her world and in turn rock your world I just realized my wedding ring wasn't on just in case somebody out there thinking oh that's fine Gab. Yeah, maybe I need to do these things for her I'm taking I'm taking I'm off the market The pandemic there's not too many um, like outings you can really plan and just have a good time but what you could do is give her a day of leisure 
So if she gets up, she gets the kids ready, she um, bathes the kids, she makes breakfast, she does this, give her a day of leisure. Um, she's getting up to her, no, no, you, you stay here, I'll take care of this. What do you need me to do? Do you know what those words mean to a woman? Those are the sexiest words you can ever tell a woman. Is there laundry that needs to be done? Do you want me to do the dishes? What do you need me to do? That's a, that, that's sexy. We don't need all this um, lingerie. We don't need this. We just need a partner who sees us, recognizes us, and wants to contribute and help. So try that. I'm, these are gems. Listen to me. Listen, these are gems. I'm dropping gems, little nuggets, little nuggets that y'all need to take, men. Listen, Liberian men, y'all listen. I said, listen, listen to me, listen, listen. One of the last things you can do, and this was not in any particular order, you can upgrade her ring if that is something that she has been wanting, or not even wanting, just the fact that you took the time out to know her measurements and upgrade her ring. What woman wouldn't want that? It's the thought that counts, even if it's not the most spectacular, just the fact that you thought about it. If you've been married, there's no reason to do a big diamond. You can also do an anniversary band, um, an early anniversary band just for Valentine's Day. Hey babe, I was thinking about you and I got you this. Believe me, all these things would be appreciated. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just a quick um, Valentine's fall her with love video. Pay attention men, pay attention. Anyway, this is Joy from She Speaks Too. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you later.